time of year again, and here we go with the flowers in a box, deals that sound too good to be true, over-promising, and under-delivering. My son yesterday called me up and he had a customer on the phone, and the customer said to him, I want to get a bouquet like I saw on the internet for $19.95, your flowers are too expensive. And he got very concerned. Right away he started thinking, how can I get a 1995 bouquet done for this customer? Only to find out that it wasn't really what it was. So he took the order, I got on the phone with him, I said, Nick, take a little look into this further. See what the checkout processes are and watch how deceptive and how slippery these companies can be with getting the person in thinking they're going to pay one amount. By the time it's over, they've spent 40 to $50, if not more. So here's a bouquet that I decided I was going to buy. Number one, it wasn't same day delivery as we always offer. It's coming, it arrives in a pretty box, but now the assembly must begin. How many people are really gonna be comfortable putting together flowers when they arrive in a box? This is really fun, right? So you're sitting at your office, and you get a package like this, open it all up, only to find there's a card, uh, carry instructions, here's the card message. And now we go into this, this ended up, by the way, costing $58. So here's my 1995 OK, which I'm going to take out. Um, very nice packaging, there's no question. Um, OK, so there's the box. Here's the packaging. And um, it's tied in there pretty well, but there's wire here. The ends of the wire are exposed. That could... Uh, be unpleasant. So by the time I unwrap this, and by the way, there was a charge for the vase. It was another six dollars for the vase. More boxing here, and here is my additional vase that I paid extra for. It is the same as it was pictured. Again, very nicely packaged. And um, here's my bouquet for $19.95. So we have a bouquet that I would sell in my store for probably a oh, Broken heads, okay. Um, several in here for probably ten to twelve dollars. A vase that we would sell for probably six dollars. Uh, I, I will have to assemble this. There are no greens to go with it. And when everything's all said and done, we have a fifty-dollar arrangement that was marketed on the internet as a great deal. And this is what a typical quality florist is up against that provides same-day service, quality product, hand-delivered and none of the above happened here. So buyers, be careful. The holidays are coming up. If you see a deal that's too good to be true, it just might be that. Happy holidays.